Hi, man, Joe Armstrong, and welcome to the back of this Teardown Lab. Another mystery type package. No idea what it is. No idea where it's from. Ooh, look at this. I do remember this now. This is a TENS unit. You can get them on, you know, various websites. Amazon, eBay, there'll be links no doubt in the uh, description. I'll pop some there. And uh, this is for if you've got, say, bad back, sporting injuries, aches and pains, or uh, even childbirth, I believe. I do remember my wife had one of these. And uh, the idea is it sort of puts an electrical current over your body, over your body, to uh, basically zap you. And that's supposed to make you feel better because you're getting zapped. So uh, this unit, I don't know if it was new or not, but it's pretty kind of pantsly made. I mean, we've I've... <laughs> ordered in the past I could definitely say more professional feeling units but let's not uh, judge a book by its cover. I've got some batteries here just to conveniently happen to have them though. Triple A's, three of those. Um, so what it does, it takes the batteries and normally puts them through a few coils. Ooh, look at that. Ah, a gotcha already. I'm going to hold it up to the camera and hopefully it'll focus. Yeah, can you see that? It appears to be in foreign, <laughs> so that's going to be an interesting one. But let's let's check out the book. Maybe the book explains. Oh, the book is in English, and it's really thin paper. It's like toilet paper, <laughs> but that's fine. So this it says is the paster, P-A-S-T-E-R, and I'm not lying, guys. Look, you can see it right there. The paster, the battery. We didn't get the battery. The by the electrode pad, the electrode. Mm -hmm. Two fastener in one electrode wire. This is the two fastener in one electrode wire. Yeah. Different therapeutic modes available. Yada, 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 yada. So, I'm going to do a brief rundown of these. And I'm going to tell you, I've got actually a pain. The reason I bought this is that I do get a pain in my lower back. You know, not my butt, but my lower back. And I'm going to show you through a diagram. I'm going to draw you a diagram because I might I might just pop the old electrodes on right now. Why don't I do that? Not on camera, but I'll show you. So if this is a human, oh, that's such a great drawing, maybe a bit slimmer. This is a human and we didn't do it from the back, so that's the human butt. This is a human butt. So there's some sort of nerve and I'm not quite sure where it runs, but it's the sciatic nerve and I'm going to guess it's running somewhere down your leg, somewhere like this, in your spine. And uh, through running or whatever, you tend to sort of get an, inf you know, you irritate it because it's moving around and then you get a pain here in your butt. And you can radiate down your leg. And if you, by the way, if you're ever doing running, you'll get loads of pains like here, knees and stuff when you start out. Get used to that though and it all goes away. But yeah, the uh, sciatic nerve thing is a bit annoying because I do boot camp, so I do like different kinds of um, prone exercises and it, they tend to irritate that. Not good. So this was going to be my cure. It will cure me. Um, and these are the pads and you can see they're sort of a squidgy gel. Ew. Very slimy squidgy gel and they sort of, you can replace them onto that. Again, I don't know if this is used or not. It's It kind of has a weird vibe about it, but I guess it's, it's unused enough for me. But before I do that, let's refine out what this thing is, though. This is the, uh, the pe what did they call that? The pasta, paster. Whenever I've used one, we've normally just sort of jam those pads on your skin. Yeah, the paster, paster. By the way, the uh, I can see here already that English is really bad, like the spelling. It's just crazy spelling. I mean, I'm just going to show you that here. Look, cupping wood jute rejuing immuhydro immurotherapy massage, um, stereotherapeutic. I mean, this this they could be real words in this whole. Oh look, here we go. Yeah, these are the <laughs> acupuncture points. So yeah, I want I want this butt area here sorted out. Um, I think I'm just gonna have to ignore all this bullshit. Look, constipation. Yeah. I guess if you maybe put it really up your butt, it's gonna get you going. I, I'm I'm worried now because I thought this is gonna be a bit like a more professional ones we've used before, which are just for pain management during childbirth, and it's they're really simple to use. Two knobs. 
uh, with less bullshitty sounding stuff. So looking at the thing, it's got two pins, so it obviously fires the same thing to each pad at once. So you clip that on the pad and then you clip the pad to your butts. Um, it doesn't look like I've necessarily got option but to do both at the same time. Let's just do that. Ah, looks like they've kind of slid off. They're so slimy, they've slid off their pads. Now these pads, by the way, are available on eBay and they can be quite expensive if you're buying them from the manufacturer's website, but just shop around because you can get them pretty cheap. Right, so I'm probably gonna jump cut now while I stick these on a different part of my body. Ooh. Right, I have them applied and uh, I'll show you where I actually put them. I kind of put one here, one here, and one here, one here. So I've just kind of gone for the general fetlocks region. So uh, I'm really scared now because I am actually hooked up to this. So I don't know if I turn it on if it's going to go mental or if it's just going to be a, a mild start. So let's see. Oh, I'm almost going to stand here, to just oh, put my hand here so I can yank this if it sort of starts caning me. Right, um, mode, let's try mode, shall we? Oh, it goes off. Ah, look, okay, so these are the different parts. Not sure what that means, but it's a bit like one of those massage chairs where it sort of goes through different symbols on the screen. Well, I'm gonna put it to the general butt area. Chi oh, hang on, it says Chinese and English, bloody hell, look at that. Why even have that as a massive button? Look. <laughs> right, this is way better for us now. S scraping, weight reducing. Oh, I want a bit of that. Immunotherapy, all of that. Right, let's put it as massage and we'll put week. Time. 10 minutes, 15 minutes, 5 minutes. Okay. Week. Strong. Ah, I feel it. Okay. Ah, more strong. You can see there's an intensity reading there now. Ah! <laughs> I half expect now someone to come in and see what the. Ah! Ah! Oh! Nice. All right. I'll tell you what it's doing, and you've got to be careful on this and why I jumped. Massage, it's doing this as if it's someone doing like that, yeah? And then it goes ding. In fact, you can hear it. I'll, I'll... Woohoo! So it gives you a long, like, you know, bow of it. I'm going to go turn the intensity down. That's cool. I don't know what the intensity goes up to, you know. I think it could go up shockingly high. I mean, I'm gonna put it, push weak a bit, weak, 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 and then unplug it. Wow, look, the intensity's going up and up, 15. I was jumping on three, and you can go up to 15. If I pull that, plug that in, I would probably have a heart attack. Um, let's put that back down to sort of one. Ah, okay, well, I think that's going to do the trick. It's <laughs> because it's got that mode where it's playing with the waveform. Um, it's going to get you. That, that, see, the medical ones are pretty much fixed <laughs> at particular patterns. So if you imagine this is a graph where this is time across the bottom and this is intensity and time. And uh, sorry, I'm not zooming. I've got a different lens on the camera. I don't really want to mess with it. Um, so what this one is doing, it's probably doing something a bit like... So that's the did 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 Now, these look like a square wave, but remember inside the unit for it to work properly, it's probably using a it's gonna be a an AC. Yeah, so that's exactly what it's doing. So because it's not quite predictable, um, that's what's gonna get you. So I'm gonna try one of the other modes. I'll put down to one. Let's go to cupping then. 
Ah, that's nice. So far, it just feels like a constant pattern, like a No, it stopped. Then start it up again. So that's it, that's fine. I can live with that. Manipulation. Ah! Oh, put it on intensity two. I felt it. intensity one, nothing. And then stopped. Oh, then it goes again. And that's a sharp pain. A sharp, I say pain, right? It's just a sharp feeling. Now it's changed again. So remember, when they're doing this, by the way, they can change the waveform. So you can actually have, remember, if you have a uh, signal generator, you can have a triangular waveform. You can have a square waveform. And you can have a sinus, sinusoidal, sinusoidal waveform. So these will be re you know, reacted to by your muscle fibers in your body in different ways, and you'll feel those as different massages. So that's interesting. So let's go to the next one, scraping. Scraping's weird, isn't it? Scraping. Fancy a bit of a sc scraping. I'm going to put it to two now. We know what two does. <sighs> so one is pretty much nothing, but jumps to two. That's going to spam you. I can hear from the unit, though. It sounds like it's a higher frequency. Definitely feels different. Definitely feels different. It's playing at a different frequency. So... So imagine between these waveforms, you have a, a certain periodicity, right? Which is from peak to peak, yeah? And that's T. So what it's effectively doing is stretching and lowering T for different parts of the program. And you, you can feel that distinctly. It's got a, it's nice. It's good, actually. It's a, it's, a, it's a good thing. Mode, weight reducing. Nothing so far, but intensity zero. Lots of spikes, like prodding. I think it's going to do the trick, you know. Though I'm really, I'm quite pleased. I'll, I'll, I'll try to dig up how much I pay for this, but it was pretty cheap. I wouldn't, I don't think I'd have paid more than ten pounds for it. You can, might be able to hear that. Oh, it's changed the pattern again. Good. I suppose it does feel a bit like a massage. I'm going to push mode, see what happens, see if it drops the intensity to zero and you switch. Yeah, that's good. Immunotherapy. Mm. Feels very much like weight reducing at the moment to me. Again, there's only so much these guys can do with these patterns. As you get used to it, though, I think you might be able to crank it up. Shall I go risk a three? Oh, yeah, that's deep. That feels like a deep massage, like someone's thumping you deep in your fibres. It's amazing that you think with just the application of the same electrodes, electricity, voltage, whatever, that you can have so many different feelings. It might even be changing polarity. I don't think it... I don't know. It, it may well be. It doesn't make sense, though, on a sinusoidal pattern. Next one, acupuncture. This sounds like it could hurt. Ah, very mild. Even on three. Now, I don't fancy the next one, though, stroke. Does that mean, like, having a stroke? Uh, yeah, like having a stroke. <laughs> it's all right, though. That's good. Whew. So there you go. It's uh, obviously in a, it can go obscenely high. Don't leave this anywhere where your kids can attack it because they're going to have some real problems with it. And I'm, I'm just looking around. It would be neat. What's in here? Oh, this is that... Um, you know, blood test thing that I don't need anymore. Maybe, yeah, it doesn't fit, but if you can get something like this that does fit, put it in one of these old cases, that would be good. We see this one's no good for me right now, but I might put it in a um, jiffy bag or something. Right, I'm just gonna peel off the electrodes. Let's have a look, see what the damage is. Ugh. Yeah, they're not really full of like hair and stuff. There's one hair, hair hairy back, that's fine. I'm wondering if this, this gadget, is to sort of meant to just hold that so you can... Oh, is it for taking them like that so you can stick this on them? Oh, did I just stick that the wrong way around? Um, 
Nah, it's kind of shiny on both sides. I think I did stick it the wrong way around, but it's shiny at both sides. So maybe that's what it is. It's just a sort of reloading, uh, reloading system. Where the hell does that other electrode gone? Oh, that's definitely on my lower back. But not hairy at all, eh? <laughs> I'm going to just try this old school. Yeah, that works too. So you're going to get a bit of uh, use out of these electrodes because clearly they don't get really ruined in the process. Um, maybe a bit of hair on them if you've got them on a hairy bit. Or uh, what I'd probably advise is if you're going to do it, maybe have a little wash before, a bath or something, so you don't get any oil on them because the oils on your skin, maybe not your you know, oils from your body, but just things you've applied like moisturisers and stuff are going to have a problem with it. And uh, you'll knacker it out. But it's, I think it's a bit like those uh, kids things that you throw and they stick on glass. It's um, like a sort of sticky, slimy, silicone-y thing. And if you wash it with a bit of washing up liquid, you might be able to get a bit more use out of them. But as I said, they're quite cheap on the eBay, these electrodes, and you can get them in massive packs of, yeah, a whole bunch of them. Uh, and they do really long ones that can go right up your back, for example, and things like that. So that could give you some comfort. I imagine this will be uh, of some relief to me should I have a uh, spinal flare-up, uh, say, come Tough Mudder or something like that, and I'll be certainly giving it a go. So, yeah, I I know I've belittled this for its sort of lack of quality, but, yeah, it's got everything you need, and it's got this little USB thing, which is a bit worrying, by the way. Um, if you're going to use this USB thing, I would advise you use it with an external battery, you know, one of those USB battery things. I wouldn't use it with a mains thing because... There's a good chance if that mains thing is a really crap, uh, again, Far East import that's not very well isolated and could go live with mains power, I would suggest uh, or expect actually this machine to electrocute you. So really, don't rely on that. Three AAA, three triple A's is fine. I mean, you're just gonna you, you have those lying around. So yeah, hope that's some use to you. Make sure you press the C H E N button at the appropriate time, unlike me. Um, and look out for them. I'll put some links uh, in the uh, description if I can, normally from Amazon. People ask me why do I buy stuff off eBay and then put them uh, Amazon links and the main reason I'll tell you is that the problem with eBay is that it's really transient. Something I find on eBay one week often isn't on there the next so Amazon at least you can see what it looks like. If you've got an Amazon account you can click on it and buy it right away and if you don't you can always look on eBay or wherever your favourite shop is and now that you've, you know, you've seen it on Amazon you can see the specs and then you can go find it. So uh, yeah, please like, uh, click subscribe uh, if you're that way inclined and of course please comment down below on your experiences of TENS machines and whether or not they've worked for you. As ever, thank you for watching. Chinese English.